Good morning, everyone. I'm going to get ready to start today's activities. Let's go. It feels so dark at 6 a.m. Hi everyone, so I'm Jesslyn and I'm from Indonesia. I'm a second year actuarial science and risk management student at Queen's University Belfast. And I'm going to show you guys how is it day in the life of an actuarial science student. And I'm kinda hungry in the morning, so let's just grab some breakfast. We're heading to the kitchen. This looks so good. Mm. And also Greek yogurt with raspberries. So this is how it looks like for my breakfast. I'm having sandwiches and also um, a bowl of yogurt with raspberries and just a bit of honey. So besides having the yogurt, I usually also have the cereal or even make my own toasties. So it's a whole meal bread and inside there's um, cheese, cranberry jams. This is so fulfilling and yet the price is so affordable because I got a reduced price yesterday. I bought it in the supermarket. So suitable for university students. So I've gone back to my room and I can see that the sun has risen. So I'm going to show you guys. So it's around 8.30 at the moment. And this is how the morning in Belfast looks like, guys. And so now I'm just going to review some of the materials for my lecture later. I think um, a routine for me to review lecture materials before the lecture to get an overview what the lecture will be about so that I can go inside the lecture and understand most of the materials given. It makes me easier to understand the lecture materials well. I usually also go through my email in the morning to know if there's any announcement. So besides studying, I'm also joining some clubs and societies at Queen's, such as Queen's Student Matters Fund, Indonesian Student Society, as well as Queen's International Student Society. Hi everyone! So the building behind me is actually Riddle Hall located in Stranmalis Row. It's where Queen's Management School is. And I'm going to the Fintro Trading Room today. It's also located in Riddle Hall. In Queen Student Managed Fund, we got to operate real money investment portfolio. And I have joined QSMF since I was in first year. I was becoming a sector analyst in the healthcare sector. I then progressed to become a sector head in second year. We even got the access to Bloomberg Terminal in the trading room, which is such a good experience when producing equity reports. So here's the trading room in Riedel Hall and I'm going to go inside for Queen Student Matters Fund meeting, especially for my sector in healthcare sector. So not only finance or even accounting or even economic students joining QSMF, but also there are some students studying engineering or even law that are so interested in investments or even finance. And I believe that my experience in QSMF, especially with my achievement in investment banking um, simulation last year, it's one of the reasons I got the offer for placement in the actuarial science degree. We are all set. Let's go to the campus. So I'm currently living in the city center because it's just so convenient that everything you want to get, you can get it here. Like there's a lot of restaurants, cafes, supermarkets, and then there's also shopping centers, which is Victoria Square. So I just want to show you guys, if you're running out of time to grab breakfast, you can get it in Tim Horton as well, because there's a really good breakfast meal deal. 
So here you can see there's any breakfast meal, 2.5 pounds, and you can get one cup of coffee, breakfast wrap, or even you can choose between this or this, and even half browns. Yeah, it's so sunny today, it's really good weather. Yeah, so this is the Christmas market in the morning, but when it gets dark, it's way more beautiful and prettier because the lights are all on and there's also um, the Christmas tree so it's just so beautiful at night so it will take me 30 minutes around 30 minutes to go to campus by walking but you can also um, go by bus or even by bicycle it's just a lot of options you can choose so if you like to take a bus, you can get a student discount fare if you have this card, the Y-Link card. And, but you can request it for free, so that's a good thing. You can get a 10% student discount for bus fare. So it's only about 2.8 pounds per day. For bicycle, you can also get a special fare. I think it's only 25 pounds annually but i really enjoy walking so i prefer walk to campus and i think it's a good exercise as well i'm heading to campus everyone and it's with my friends hey sankhya um, what course are you guys doing we're both studying finance yeah we're studying finance <laughs> Starting ways because I'm going to library, they're going to tutorial class. So I'm going to the library first before going to lecture because I'm having a group assignment meeting with my classmates. group project meeting and I'm going to head to the junction to get some lunch. It's around 12.14 now and my lecture will be at 1 so I still have time to grab some lunch in the junction. Let's go! We're having lunch now. Hi everyone! Hi! This is Orca, Anna, and Katie. We're having lunch together. So the actual science and risk management degree covers a mix of mathematics, specifically in probability and statistics, then economics, financial analysis, as well as more into actual calculations, for instance calculating insurance premiums or valuing pension scheme. So we deal with a lot of long-term calculations and risk management, which is applicable not only in the actual industry, but also in wider finance field. We are also exposed to a lot of software such as Excel, VBA, Python, and also our programming, which are such valuable skills that we need to have when we go into the workplace. Hi everyone, so we have just finished from Nail's class, and here we have our lecturer. Can you introduce yourself? Hi all, my name is Neil McConville. I'm the program director for the actual science degree. I'm also the qualified actuary and the current second year lecture to our fine second year students. Wow, that's really cool. How do you find teaching us, Neil? They're not too bad. <laughs> I like students who engage in class. I like the people who ask questions. It makes it a bit more interesting as well. Jessen's very good. She's oh, not afraid thank to you. answer questions and also not afraid to ask questions as well. So 
I like the bit of interaction, I like to have a bit of fun in the lectures as well. It makes it a bit more interesting for me. Nobody likes to hear this voice for longer than an hour. <laughs> Alright then, thank you very much. Not See you later in the next lecture. All right. Bye folks! Bye. <laughs> Hi guys! <laughs> Done! Hello! Rimbing! Rimbing! Hi! Hi. <laughs> So after the lecture, we were having um, short breaks, having a chit chat, and yeah, got some fun. So after the lectures, we finally made our time um, to go to Christmas market together. It's my first time to be in Christmas market in Belfast and it was really amazing as well. There's a lot of people so it was quite packed. So I really want to go to Christmas market again in some other times, trying different kinds of food as well as um, desserts because there's just a lot of options. Going this one, Swanson. Yeah. Bye bye. See you. See you. Heading home. So I'm just going to stroll around city center, get my dinner, as well as buying groceries. So yeah, that's all for the night. Belfast is not too large that you can still feel at home, but it's not too small as well that there's a lot of things to offer. Spring rolls and salt and pepper chicken, chicken curry, and then also rice. Let's eat. This is so good. Mm, the portion is so large as well. It's impossible for me to finish all of this, so I'll probably just eat a bit more and save it for tomorrow. So this is spring roll. Okay. It's so crunchy. So I'm done with my dinner and I'm just going to head over to JD because JD just opened like last Friday which is oh last Thursday 18th of November so I'm just going to come here All I want Next Friday is a Black Friday sale so probably just wait for the sale that is coming up. The city center is so lively, guys, especially at night. Right, so I'm heading to the supermarket now. Let's just go straight for about one minute and I'll be arriving in the supermarket. going to 
get. Let's just go to the fast food section. Reduced price for pork loin medallions, but it expires at tomorrow. And the original price is this, 2.69. So yeah, I'm gonna get this. And so I got this package for free from NHS And I'm gonna do it now I think it's just so important to take a regular lateral flow task so that I can keep myself safe and others safe as well so the result has come out and it turns to be negative so what I'm going to do next is probably just reviewing next lecture's materials and then get some rest so I'm kind of done for the day and thank you very much everyone for following my journey today day in the life of an actual science student at Queen's University Belfast Thank you very much for watching and I hope you really like it and see you in the next video Bye! Good night everyone!